Hello folks, Sam from the Giant Tortoise Farm here today with something really special. This is a surgically sexed pair of Aldabra tortoises. This is the female and this is the male. Surgically sexed at this age is really something special because you know exactly what these animals are going to grow up to be. You cannot determine sex at this age or this size with Aldabra tortoises. That's why a lot of people are interested in surgically sexed Aldabra tortoises. You can't do a DNA test because they're not sex linked through DNA. Their sex is determined by incubation temperature, which is, you know, another neat thing about Aldabra yeah. tortoises. The females actually determine the sex of, of the species by how deep they dig the nest. So when they dig the nest deep, they're, they produce males. When they dig the nest shallow, that nest temperature is warmer, so they produce more females. And the really interesting thing about Aldabra tortoises is the female will actually determine the sex ratio of the herd. She gets an understanding if there's enough males or if there's enough females. And based on that determination, she'll determine the depth of that nest that she'll actually, uh, how deep she'll actually dig, dig it down so that she can control that sex ratio, which is really amazing. I mean, these animals are really advanced when it comes to planned parenthood. So. Another interesting thing about the females is not only do they determine the sex ratio, when they, they mate with the male, they actually will store sperm for three years, which means they inseminate themselves as time goes on. They can abort. They don't have to produce the offspring uh, if they don't want to. So what they're really looking for is the perfect environment for the babies to hatch. Anyway, Back to what's really special about this surgically sexed pair. Now, these animals are pit tagged. Let me give you a demonstration of that. This is the male, ID number 1842. But if you look, you can see he has a pit tag number. What's really neat about that pit tag number is that allows you to permanently identify that animal. So you can get on a national registry. You can get on a national registry with these animals and you and you register that uh, your name and your address and the pit tag number. And if that tortoise is ever lost or stolen, you can always prove ownership through that pit tag. So that's something that's really that's really neat with these uh, Aldabra tortoises, especially this particular group. So it's very unusual uh, to, to get males because in, in the herd, let me just stop you for a second.